When it comes to etiquette, most people often think solely of good manners. But according to recent studies, etiquette is growing in popularity because it promotes effective communication and builds positive relationships. Here to discuss the benefits of starting etiquette training at a young age is CEO of Poised and Proper Etiquette Consulting, Nicole Rose. Good morning, Nicole. Hi, Jessica. Thank you so much for having me on the show. Of course. Wonderful to be talking about this. You know, we were kind of chit-chatting off camera mm -hmm. um, and I want to get right into it so what made you get into the etiquette business I know it's it's a unique industry yes. so as as a young girl I've always been um, one who wants to do things the right way and make people feel included and respected um, which was something my grandmother instilled in me she actually enrolled me in etiquette training as a young girl so then I started dealing blackjack on the strip for 10 years. Wow. <laughs> I noticed a really big need for etiquette in our community. Mm -hmm. Then I uh, taught fifth grade for five years and I saw it on the other end of the spectrum with children who also needed etiquette. And two of those years were through the COVID pandemic. Mm. So we all needed a little reminder how to interact with humans again mm -hmm. and, and have those communication skills. So that's what ultimately inspired me to begin Poised and Proper. Gosh, I love that. Just even from your experience in the casino, right? Yeah. Like, I've seen a lot. I, I, was, I was like a fly <laughs> on the wall, and yeah. you do see a lot. So. Yes, and now, so your business, you kind of cover, You, I think you said it was three different categories when it comes to etiquette. Let's talk about that. Yeah, so for my children's classes, I offer social etiquette, dining etiquette, and then college and career readiness etiquette. So the social etiquette course is a six-week course where we meet once a week for 75 minutes, and we talk about about all things social, building and maintaining friendships, relationships, mm. how to be a gracious go uh, guest or host. Um, we talk about uh, posture and uh, what your body language says about you. Um, in our dining class, that's a five-week program. We also meet for 75 minutes and we learn how to order from a waiter, how to read a menu, mm. how to use table manners, how to use cutlery and napkins correctly, how to even tip correctly. Um, and then that class is super fun because it culminates with the student and one adult guest at a restaurant so they can show off their skills to their family. Wonderful, wonderful. Mm -hmm. You know, so I want to know what some tricks and tips are that you know, you, you would provide to kids and teens who are maybe struggling with even making friends because you mentioned even in those social settings is what you're preparing them for essentially, right? Exactly, yeah. So some tips and tricks for younger children to make friends is just start off by introducing yourself and then asking for the other person's name. Then you can ask them if they want to play with you. It's a lot mm -hmm. easier when you're a kid, yeah. you know, to make <laughs> friends, but just ask if they want to play with you. And then I think one of the most important things is to just have a good attitude. A lot of times kids get upset if they lose mm -hmm. or if somebody doesn't want to share with them. But if you maintain a positive attitude, um, that makes people want to be around you more. So I think those are some good tips for kids. Absolutely. And so in talking about where we are today, you know, you had mentioned your journey and seeing some things through the pandemic. We also know that right now we live in a very digital and social age. And so there was something I found interesting called netiquette, yes. right? Netiquette. Talk to us about that. So online etiquette or netiquette is just how to be respectful online. Mm. So um, I think some important things about children who are online is to remember their safety first and foremost. With the amount of time that kids spend on social media today, it's easy to feel comfortable with the connections that you make online. And it's important for parents to remind their kids that you should never get out your full name, your school, your address, or anything like that um, to strangers online. And then secondly, I like to say, remember the human. Right. When we're online, we are with a screen in front of our face and we can't see the other person behind the screen. So a lot of times it's easy to pass quick judgments or be rude to somebody because you can't see them. But I like to just live by the motto, if you have nothing nice to say, 
Don't, right, don't say, say it at all. all. Right, exactly. right. Well, well, Nicole, this has been great. Before we go, I definitely want to talk about, you have an upcoming event and a special offer. I do. So let's talk about the event. Oh, the event. So my Modern Lady event is happening August 19th at the Gathering Place. This is a day for you and your gal pals to just experience everything feminine. So we're going to be arranging flowers. We're going to set the table. We're going to strut our stuff in high heels. We're going to learn to speak eloquently. And we're also going to learn how to voice a complaint politely. Um, and handle awkward situa situations with finesse and poise. Wonderful. That sounds like a lot of fun. And then you also have a special offer for our Morning Blend viewers. I do. So my fall etiquette classes are on their way. So they're going to be beginning on August 20th. And I would love to offer viewers the chance to have a bundle. So social etiquette and dining etiquette, which is normally priced together at $900. I would love to offer it for $700. If they just mention the morning blend to me, I'll give them a discount code so they can get that bundle for $700. That is so wonderful. Nicole, thank you so much for coming in this morning. My pleasure. And talking about this, because this has been wonderful and, and sharing your expertise with us as well. For more <laughs> information, you can call the phone number or visit the website, both right there on your screen. You can also connect with Poised and Proper on all social media platforms.